pretty sure. Wario. Oh right, I forgot YMCA it does have a Wario as well. And in this matchup, it's no surprise that he would off for a Wario because Meta Knight, those ladder combo or that up air rather, can do a lot. Alright, so pop into game one, taking it to Pokemon Stadium. And, you know, this is going to be very slow, I think, really, just because Wario wants to go ahead and get in on Meta Knight, but Knight possessing just enough disjoint on his sword to really keep Wario at bay. But when Wario is able to go ahead and get in there, when he lands that neutral air, whether it be the very first hit or just the falling hit, it's going to lead it to so much damage. And then in the later game, you have to be very, you know, aware of that walk. You lose your stock very early. Oh, that tornado hitting the wrong way from this. He was able to catch the... Oh, no! That was the strangest trajectory. That neutral air should not be sent in that direction, but... I mean, it was, a, it was the back hit of the neutral air, so it's, it's not too surprising. But it ends up trading with the upbeat as well, so... It's very unfortunate for YMCA, but he's trying to get himself back into this game. All right, down throw into the up air strings. It looks like it works pretty well on side, Mario! Oh, no! I, 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 think, I think we're playing the wrong game. We might need to uh, change games real quick. Back to Smash for Wii U. Oh, goodness. Good stuff from Destiny, really showing what Meta Knight can do here in Smash Ultimate. The YMCA is still really struggling to get anything going. He's looking for a lot of these down tilt confirms, but unfortunately he's doing it on shield. So he's, he's kind of just hoping, okay, I want this to poke. I want you to either drop shield or something or another. Oh no, okay, fortunately YMCA got air dodgers out of it this time. He's still keeping up the pressure though, just sliding right in with that tornado. A lot of buttons were just smashed right there. That was very uh, sluggy. Oh, oh, okay. okay, thank goodness to punish the missed up here. Because if you can't punish those moves, like when you're down this much, it will really get to you. You can get super tilted if you can't punish the most basic. Alright, well, he, he got the best equalizer in the game. Walk is now online. You need to neutral air or even just a falling up air to confirm and get the stock off. There's a down throw yet again. Destiny is taking full advantage of it to get Wario off of him. First to the fair, I wonder if that confirms that. It looks like he probably could have caught a grab or even just you know, maybe a jab or something. But, it, but he did it again and he ended up getting the second hit and he got the pop up, which he was completely expecting. It's just YMC went a little bit too far. Alright, I think YMCA might be saving this uh, walk for his very last start because he has not thrown out so far, and at this point, it's he even. doesn't need it. It's even. So, yeah, this is a very scary for Destiny. He cannot do something safe like that down special. Oh, he was so scared that air dodge. He just went far enough for that up tilt to not land. Destiny on the second least of life right now, but all the momentum is on YMCA's side. All right, there goes another up toad. Needs to be careful. Rolling back. Uh, Fortunately enough, he didn't do the slash. Yeah, I, I guess those down specials are, they don't have that much end lag, but he should still be really careful because if YMCA knows where he's going with that down special, he could just go over and walk. Wait a minute. Oh, that he's good. It was just a weak hit. Lost the one line. No, oh, he just no. did it. He just did it. He went for the read and <gasps> for the firm wait, but he reads that spot dodge with the forward smash. He still has a chance. Oh, he ends up getting the grab Boy, finally. Bro. Oh, how did that hit? That was, he was on like the other side of him. That sword's too big. Oh no. I mean, Wario a big boy too. Like you know, it's definitely gonna be hitting anywhere. Oh. YMCA bringing it so close, but Destiny able to nab that game with me, right? It's just, wow. <laughs> Speechless, that was just so close. Yeah, definitely great stuff from Destiny to go ahead and clutch out that game, but fantastic stuff from YMCA, really on that last stock, just showing what Wario can do and what caliber of player that he is. Running it straight back to Pokemon Stadium, too. Yeah, I feel like this game will be a lot more even than how the first game started out, where Destiny sort of got away with those really long, really long, really high percent combo shows. 
But we got a hot 61 already racked up onto Destiny and YMCA carrying on where he left off in that last stock. Finally, Destiny able to land the last hit of that back here. Now YMCA on the defense of getting carried off of the side possibly again. No, going to the back air. Not going to connect though. I love the uses of Tornado there to like make it there in time to punish the air down. However, <laughs> that four tilt, sometimes you just get slapped in the face and you lose it stock. There goes the forward throw, neutral air. I didn't realize, just off of a short hop, actually clipping right underneath the uh, platform of the stadium. Not going to do it either. Neutral Air not connecting into anything. And YMCA able to go to up B out of shield. Another up B to rack up some more percent. He was just waiting for Destiny to go ahead and land. I thought there was a little more lag on that F tilt, but unfortunately enough, he's able to go ahead and get up. And wow, just enough invincibility on there from the uh, dimensional eight to not get punished. Down tilt into dash attack, and I believe I saw the spark. So Waff is online for YMCA. Oh, and I think he wanted it there. He wanted the up tilt into Waff. Oh, is that down there into uh, Shuttle Loop? Okay. Oh, man. Okay, he's Fight. finally... Yeah, he's showing him the pearly whites real quick. Can he go ahead and get the hands again? Nope. Dash attack. Give him that shoulder ramp. It's not going to take the stock, but basically the next big hit will go ahead and get either of the stock from these players. And as I say, it's down tilt. Leading to the dash attack. Great confirmed that Wario possesses. Destiny now on his last stock against the Wario that just ate some Chipotle. Yeah, this is the exact opposite of last game. Now, Destiny was the one down one to three. He does take the first stock though, and I wonder, I wonder if we could possibly see the potential comeback. Oh, that sends the other way, so Destiny has one last chance at life. Late into the dash attack. Just keep putting back up into the air. And Destiny landing down back there of himself. But still, he's just not getting enough. Okay, YMC, getting a little bit percent and making sure that Wap comes back just a tiny bit faster. Oh, that get up attack. Okay, we might get a nice ladder here. No. Take more damage on the miss up special. Another bear. Man, but just how does he come back here? Oh, he's trying to take him off the side from the down air. Okay. Neutral Air gonna go ahead and clip. Has YMCA taking advantage of the bike recovery to come back. He didn't believe in the down tilt. He didn't believe in that last one. That was, he definitely hit it. He could have got the confirm, but unfortunately, back right off shuttle loop out of shield. Getting YMCA off of him, and that should be the stock. Yes. yes the down smash. Just, just spin on him. Just. What does he even do then? He just sort of wobbles on the ground. And yeah, there's just way too much lag at the end. <laughs> All right. Heading into a game three situation between these two players. Destiny taking a drink of water, keeping himself composed. He was playing very well that first game. This YMCA seems to run away with that second one though. Okay, Town and City gonna be the pick. Which is mm, actually I like it just because you're you're gonna limit the Potential of dying off the ceiling from Meta Knight and now. Uh, well, this he has is to rely on. Destiny's counter pick, isn't it? Because YMC went. Uh, YMC oh, yeah, I'm tripping. I'm definitely tripping. I think maybe the platform layout could help, like, extend his ladder combos in a way. I mean, at the same time, big save, so you're not going to die to walk so easily. So if he wants to rely on more neutral and just edge guarding in general, say. Okay? Just going to hop right into it. Neutral leading into two claps immediately. 38% racked up onto Destiny. And wow, double jab as well. You don't really see jab come out from Wario too often. All right. Okay, falling down with that forwarder, leading into yet another forwarder. Destiny just trying to toss out this sword. Which is not really more that down here at the tail end. Alright, punishing the landing down air with a down throw. YMCA does not have his bike online, so he's gonna be have to be very careful off stage. That that's gonna be it. The tornado trading with Wario's up special and Destiny, he, he needed that because he like YMCA was playing so good at the start of that game. 
Up smash, old town of the city counted pick. Working very well for Destiny. Oh. Yeah, YMCA. Like, he is just preemptively doing an option from these down tilts, whether he is hitting on shield or not. It's because he understands that Destiny is going to stay content just keeping up in his shield, that that dash attack is not going to get punished at the end of it. That Shut guy on the up airs was very scary, unfortunately. But fortunately, we are on town and city, so maybe that's why YMCA died that way, because he knew he wouldn't die to Shuttle Loop. Instead, Destiny is the one who will be dying to dash attack off the side. Yeah, Destiny finally went with the slash out of the dimensional cape. Uh, at the end of it, it was way too much lag. So YMCA taking full advantage, taking advantage of neutral layers as well, but ends up getting stuck on that platform. Raised the roof a couple of times on those up tilts into the clap. Okay, he's gonna get a grab. No, he ends up jumping up with the neutral layer, and that bike actually just saving his life. That parry was so nice, YMCA, and there's so much like lag on it too. Okay. Both players throwing out smash attacks. Neither one connecting, though. Uh-oh, can he make it back? Yes, he can. Very fortunate for YMCA. That was a little scary at the end of it, just because his head ended up bonking underneath the stage. Yeah, definitely. Okay, yes, back throw will be the throw of choice here. Definitely taking his time getting back to the ledge. Oh, calling out the jump with the up smash, and now YMCA has a very narrow lead. I think one shuttle loop might be able to kill at this percent. And four throw, just send him right off that stage. Again, still going for the dimensional cape. Can't get anything out of it. Back air finally able to go ahead and catch YMCA, doing it out of shield after the first initial hit from the other back air that was on shield. We have a tense last stock situation here. Seems like Destiny is slowly taking the lead with these aerials just hitting one at a time. Oh my goodness. So many up tilts. Keep, just keep up with the up tilts. He has walk on line still. So YMCA is in a fantastic position of hitting the stock very early. Destiny is definitely just ready for it. Trying to do anything safe uh -oh, on that shield with that jab punished. is scary. That was definitely walked. Oh, that, oh, he just he just did it raw. YMCA clutches it out. Game three. Yeah, I think I don't think I've ever seen Tomahawk walk. Wow. Just jump straight up in his.